Well, it's the last month of the year and I wanted to make this video since a long time. Customizing your Android device is always a fun. Here I am sharing a few of the apps that I use to make my device look awesome anytime, anywhere. So hit the like button, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, sit back and let's get started. So the very first thing while customizing your Android is by choosing a proper wallpaper. Well for me, Wallpy wallpaper app does the job pretty well. It has huge collection of some amazing wallpaper to improve the way your device looks. You have ample amount of categories to choose from, however you will get a decent wallpaper in the first page itself. After the proper wallpaper, the next thing that makes your device appealing is the icons. For me. I use the simple icons from Yook and Delta. Well, these icon packs have simple yet stunning looking icons. However, you can choose different icon pack to change the monotonous look of your device. Moving on, almost 80% of us are still on Android Nougat and waiting for the Oreo update. Well, with the app material notification shade, you can change the look of your status bar to the one similar to Oreo. Also, you get a chance to change the theme of the status bar to dark, colored or a customized one. Talking about status bar, we also have a battery status in our panel. But if you ever wanted it to be replaced by something innovative, this app battery meter lets you do the same. You can choose from variety of meter that shows up right in the middle of the top side of the screen. This meter stick around almost on all the apps so that you can check your battery status on the go. Did you know you can extend the usage of your existing physical buttons on the device? With the app button mapper, you can choose the button and assign different tasks to it. You also get option to map on single, double and long press. Which means you can map almost three tasks to a single button. I think this will probably boost anyone's efficiency with their smartphone. Well, coming to the end of the video, let's talk about some add-ons you can do. Adding a widget can immediately game up your home screen setup. Get a Zupa widget pro and then have an awesome widget pack to accompany it. Here, I again use the Uke widgets. It has some decent looking widget which is fully customizable according to one's choice. Also, you can improve your boring looking navigation bar by adding some motion theme to it. The app Nave Bar Animation lets you choose and add some fantastic motion to your navigation bar. However, most of them are available in pro version. You can still choose from few that comes with free version. Well, that's it from this side guys. I hope you enjoyed watching this. So start crushing your Android customizing game. This is Abhishek and I'll catch you in my next one.